Hey guys, Real Toilet Spark here back with another video. Um, I'm still trying to figure out my phone here to film videos, so. Anyway, I got some diecast yesterday. Um, uh, here's the first one. This video will be uploaded in a few days for various reasons. But anyway, um, so the first car I picked up, I didn't, I already opened it right away because, like, I was so excited to get it. Like, you should have seen me in this one. I was like, <gasps> But the first car I got was Case Kane's number 95 from wave number uh, 6. So yeah, it's, uh, I don't know where the magnet is. I put it somewhere. Um, I'm at my mom's place right now. But yeah, so there's the 95. Next car, Chase Elliott's number 9, Sun Energy. This is not the walking's going to win. Shoot, I wish. Oh, um, I should probably show you guys the back. Fingers covering the damn thing. So they had all except for Kyle Larson's number 42. Which I was really disappointed because that was one I actually wanted to pick up. But uh, I threw a Kurt Busch. Well, no, no, no. I threw a Kyle Busch in a uh, number 19 of St Daniel Suarez and a number 4 um, behind uh, uh, some toys. At Walmart, so that way I could pick them up if they're still there where I hit them. Um, I didn't want to spend. Up oh shoot! <laughs> I just knocked my phone over. Anyway, I didn't want to spend my entire check on just diecast and stuff. And actually, before I even picked up any of these cars from Wave Six, I actually found a Wave Four car. I think it was. So here's a look at the magnet. Pretty sweet. These honestly look like pit signs or something. Or like the banners that go on the side of the wall there for pit road. Uh, the number 9 is crooked and pushed too far to the left if you notice. Hold on, maybe I can see if I can... Okay, there, now it's focusing. You see how the 9 is, like, crooked back a little bit, and then it's, like, pushed, but... Oh, well, I might pick up another one, because they had so many of these in stock, so I guess if it's uh, that bad, then I'll pick another one up. love how they did the orange rims, too. That's actually pretty cool. On to the next. Next car I picked up, obviously, was going to be an Xfinity car from this wave. I found, like, two or three of these. I was actually pretty shocked to find this one at least. So, I would tell his number one. I might pick up a second one because he is retiring, so I'll keep one in the box, you know. Like, I remember Elliot Sadler being one of my favorites when I was younger. Um, to be honest, he was a dick to me in my NASCAR Heat 2 career. Like, I hated him in, in Heat 2. He was a dick. I wrecked him every chance I could because he just, like... He, there have been times where he's wrecked me all for a win in my career, and, like, it seemed like it was intentional, and I was like, what the fuck, I barely did anything to you, but, anyway, there's the, oh yeah, excuse my language, by the way, any kids watching this, uh, please watch this video with, uh, adult supervision, um, uh, here's the magnet, um, honestly, I like this Xfinity car, but I have a feeling that, like, the it's, it's kind of growing on me over last year's car. I will admit that. It is growing on me. Yeah, at first I was like, eh, I don't know. But it's 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 growing on me. It really has grown on me. Here's a look at the die cast. Really, really nice die cast. Actually, the Camaro logo isn't all that bent up either. It's really not bent or anything or crooked. Everything actually looks pretty pretty legit on it there you go there's something going on right there but uh other than that the die cast looks pretty legit i'm actually a fan of this car so i have a junior motorsports car and another xfinity car so finally I think the only xfinity cars i have are the two time majeski cars we got which is the biddle honey and the iRacing scheme I got Kevin Harvick's uh, 
Hun Brothers Pizza. I didn't get the other one, but, um, yeah. I think those are the only expensive cards I got. And this one I found at Casey's Gas Station. They had this one, and then they had Brad Kozlowski's, uh Discount Tires car from Wave 1, and then they had, um... Kevin Harvick's um, number 98 Xfinity car. I almost grabbed that one, but when I saw the idea, I'm like, fucking, I'm grabbing the... That's the whole reason I wanted to go to Casey's, was to get the Kevin Harvick car. But when I found the um, Alex Bowman, I'm like, <gasps> I'm getting it, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. I just hate, the one thing that I hate is this right here. It's a cool display piece, but I still hate it because it's a HUD. It's a hood, guys. It's another plastic hood. So anyway. Now the car now the part you really want to see is the die cast. Look at that. This is honestly one of my favorite paint schemes of 2018 right there. Um, the only Alex Bowman's that I do have, I actually have, if you follow me on my Instagram, um, I have like three or... Yeah, I think I have like three Alex Bowman uh, nationwide insurance cars. One of them I turned into a custom, and then another one I'm turning into a custom. Uh, someone said I should, like, destroy one and, like, make a damaged model one, but... Or, um, some other people on Instagram told me that I should donate them to them or, like, send them to them to make customs for me or, like... Or whatever. Or, like, uh, someone... Some other people were telling me that... Oh, first I thought I couldn't roll. Um, some people were telling me that, like, uh, they wanted me to send one to them because they couldn't find one at their local store or whatever, but... I mean, I don't really send stuff out to people. I don't really deal with that whole packaging shit and, like, shipping shit out and whatever. But, anyway, back to this car. This is one of my all-time favorite schemes of this year. Like, this is just a bad... This, honestly, is giving me, like, a freaking 90s vibe or a 1980s vibe. Like, you know, like, the video games and stuff like that. Or, like, PlayStation and shit. That's what, that's what this car is giving me. It's giving me, like, that 80s vibe or something. I don't know. Someone have to let me know in the comments. But this thing is cool. But, anyway. Uh, <sighs> good lord. I am yawning. Anyway, you guys. Uh, if you guys went on to like the video, a like rating would, of course, be greatly appreciated. Yeah, if you guys want to like the video, uh, please smack the hell out of that thumbs up button. Shit, hold on. Okay, yeah. If you like the video, smack the hell out of that like button. Comment, rate, and subscribe, all that good stuff. And we will see you guys in the next video. Remember, this video is being recorded about a day or two before it gets uploaded. There, There's... There's reasons why I'm not uploading this right away, but just understand. Alright, talk to you guys later. Comment, rate, subscribe, all that stuff. Hit smack the hell out of that like button, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Or the next stream. Deuces.